let mu of n be the Mobius function. In this video, I'm going to find mu of 100 and mu of 122. So we are given those two. The Mobius function is defined as mu of n, which is equal to 1 if n is equal to 1, minus 1 to the power t if n is equal to p1, multiplied by p2 up to pt, where the pi's there are distinct primes and zero otherwise. So when you are looking at uh, the first one there, mu of 100, I will find the prime factorization of 100. The prime factorization of 100 is 2 times 2 times 5 times 5. In this case, we are having these primes here. And these primes, they are not distinct. In this case, we are having the primes that we are having there. 2, 2. Not, 2 is not distinct from 2. So it fits in the category of the otherwise here. So we have that mu of 100 is equals to 0. Now going on to the next part there, mu of 122. I will look at the prime factorization of 122, and that's 2 times 61. So in this case, these two primes, they are distinct. So what we'll be having there is, we are just having two distinct primes. So our t is a 2. So put t equals to 2 here. So we'll be having minus 1 squared. And minus 1 squared would give us a 1. So we'll have there that mu of 122 is equals to a 1. 